Well, there's always a special feeling when Hamza Chimaev makes the walk, whether at welterweight or at middleweight. This man has proven to be a real problem and really has lived up to all the hype and then some dating to his 2020 UFC debut. It's so hard for you to meet expectation, much less exceed it. Right. Hamza Chimaev has exceeded the expectations set for him when he made his UFC debut. He has been nothing short of a buzzsaw, just going through guys at a rate that not anyone could have expected. What a fantastic fighter we get to watch every time we see Hamza in the octagon. And of course, many people harken back to the Gilbert Burns fight in 2022, the consensus fight of that year in which Chimaev was challenged and still rose to the occasion. We'll see how he fares tonight. Introductions. We go inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending UFC welterweight champion of the world, Kobe Chaos Covington. Herb Dean, our referee for this one. Wait. All right, so here we go with this highly anticipated stand-up only event. You gotta play by the rules here. There are a ton of them, but there is no grappling of any type, either on the feet or on the ground. Fighters cannot do follow-up strikes on the floor as well, so that bears watching here as round one gets underway. Throwing that jab yet again. Oh, yeah. Great technique with the overhand, now he's hooked. That's one of those shots, and if you take one of them, it's in the night, that one landed right on the spot. Oh, huge kick to the leg. Look for him to throw that overhand here again. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. What a fight we got going on here. All right, so one minute into the fight, and I'm not sure these fighters realize that we got three or five rounds tonight. No feeling out process at all. From the moment this fight started, these two gentlemen were ready to knock each other's heads off. Well, it seems like there has been an opening for that overhand all night long. Let's see if he goes back to it here. Oh, nice combination, yeah. Under three minutes now to go in the round. Shot there, DC, and one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is gonna be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. Oh! Oh! 
Well, his opponent seemed to be stunned to a significant extent, but was able to recover, and it's almost like he let him off the hook. Let him let him off the hook. He needed to really put his foot on the gas to try to find that fit. Oh! They're going at it here. Huge shots landing on both sides. Oh, my goodness. Oh! Beautiful combination. What a huge blow. Oh, oh another one. All right, you see his high-level footwork here, maybe trying to set up that hook shot again, potentially. You could tell, John, he's setting a trap. He's trying to walk his opponent back into his hook side, his big power side, so he'll keep faint, not little. Oh, yeah. Well, it looks as though that... to see another round. You saw him get knocked out near the end of the round. If there were 10 more seconds, that likely would have been the end of his night. All right, so his legendary chin holds up despite getting knocked down in that previous round. DC, take us through the highlight. He's as tough as they come. There has not been a guy that can take shots like this. Most times, the night would be over. And gladly, gladly over after you take a shot like this. But this man is just too tough. Some people say he's too tough for his own good. He would not agree with you. He wants to fight. You ready to fight? Ready. Second round on the way. Do you believe it? This next round is underway. In the previous round, both fighters got rocked. Crowd going bananas. Big opportunity for both fighters. These are... Oh, no! Serve him up. Go get him. Beautiful level change. Make him think you're going low and to fight over the top with that beautiful overhand. Great punch. Big right hand lands. Just misses with a left hook there. Nice defense there. Huge block. Straight right, he misses. Shumayev's cut now above the eye, courtesy of that strike. We will keep an eye on it as the fight continues. Oh, he's going to get him, bro. Oh, he gets back up. The question is, for how long? Big knee there. Too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Beautiful combination to get the knockdown. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 48 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout and new undisputed UFC welterweight champion of the world, Hobbs and Bars Kamaya. 
Kamsa Chimaev, your winner by knockout here tonight. Not quite as quick as the knockout of Gerald Mershart, but another quick night at the office for the undefeated Hamza Chimaev. Yeah, a massive night for Hamza Chimaev to go out there and do it again. To go out there and show that he is one of the best in the world by earning a massive knockout victory.